everybody. Uh, today we're gonna do. Should I uh, should I say our names? I didn't think that through. Sure. Have we ever done that? I don't think we have. Oh. <laughs> okay. Alright. Roll it back. <laughs> <laughs> the vlog is called right. Murray and Jess, but we could be like Penelope and Stacy for all <laughs> anybody. What if they don't know which one's which? <laughs> That's true. Oh, that's true. Have <laughs> we ever done that? that? I don't think we've ever done that. I feel like people have to guess. I think we fit our names. Hi, everybody. Uh, I'm Jess. I'm Maria. And today we're going to talk about our March reset recap. Mm -hmm. Which I don't know if I'd say it was a major success or a major failure. Yeah. Meh. Meh. I'm gonna be real with you guys. I don't remember specifically what I said. Like, I don't have a list in front of me. Um, I know, at least for me, I had a lot of stuff that I was like, ooh, I'm gonna do this daily. And I definitely, I don't know if I said daily. I hope I didn't. I definitely like implemented more meditation and like stretching, things like that, that I said I wanted to incorporate mm. more. I just didn't do them daily. I did daily for like the first two weeks, and then life just kind of happened. Yeah. We had a lot of things come up that we weren't planning for. It's kind of a bad month for yeah. a reset. First off, I both Cephas, my dog, is chewing a bone in the background. Yeah. So that's that obnoxious noise you hear. Sorry. <laughs> um, anyway, yeah. Uh, I don't know. It just didn't... It, like, I feel like I, I added some habits. And I think I did okay overall. But March really did turn out to be a tough month. We both ended up, like, going away quite a few times. Mm -hmm. And it just... It was kind of a lot. The she spent like hours and hours in a car each weekend. And yeah, like long trips like that. It has been a lot, and it's been situations where both times were with like my boyfriend's family. So I was like, I'm not gonna film. We did film most days. Mm -hmm. I will say that. So like we did very good on that. Honestly, I think we're not gonna post the last couple days. No, it's we're really tired. We don't. We're like just it. such a long month. <laughs> It just, it ended up being a lot this month. I went, so she did her trips during the weekends and then the weekends when she was gone, I, we mentioned before um, that we're both a part of a ghost hunting group. Mm -hmm. And so Jay sat these ones out, but Cody and I, my husband decided to go. And like, they're a lot of fun, but it's literally an entire weekend of like staying up until five and six in the morning and running off of four or five hours of sleep both Friday and Saturday night and then coming home on Sunday and crashing and you're then, like drained for a week yeah and then getting ready for work on Monday morning for the week and so we did two of those this month and we have another one coming up next weekend so like this week honestly I felt kind of guilty because I really didn't do a whole lot for the reset like I just I don't know also I'm trying to finish a book, and oh, I did, I did finish it. A Court of Thorns and Roses, that series. Finally finished the series. Finally. Worth it. <laughs> it's Silver Flames, there's no reason it should have been 800 pages. So that's, I've been trying to finish the series. I've been trying to finish that book is like 800 pages. So I was feeling guilty this week because I'm like, I didn't walk. I really didn't do much for like my reset because I'm trying to catch up on house chores from being gone all weekend and I'm still so tired. And I was like, I have to finish this damn book. It was a week overdue at the library with people waiting on it. But part of our goals was to like have grace. And I think that yeah. I got in my head for, especially the first couple of weeks, like I was like really trying to be like on it. And then mm -hmm. I had that first trip and it just threw me like off kilter. And I like, I felt bad for like not getting things done or not doing enough. Yeah. Or that like my videos were the same. And I was like, well, it's kind of, it, the videos were more just an exercise for us to be like, okay, like getting, getting the used habit, to it yeah. and getting in the habit, which honestly, I don't plan to do a lot more of. Uh, I like these videos. I just yeah. I don't like the little videos. We'll we'll do them here and there. It just will likely never be that consistent again. There is <laughs> it just it kind of added to more stress this mm -hmm. month. If anything, like Jay said, we wanted to do it to get into the habit of posting things and like trying to like I don't know like I guess build up a base of our videos and everything mm -hmm. but this month like I said it just ended up being crazy because not only were we gone a lot so trying to get back into like daily life stuff you know you get behind I get behind on cleaning my house and the chicken coop and everything like that and then plus 
we're editing videos like crazy because we're editing a TikTok every day each. And two like long videos. Yes, maybe. we're each editing a long video every week. Plus, we're taking the time to get together and film these videos. Plus, we're just doing all this stuff and trying to add these new habits into our life in the same month. It just ended up being more, and then me trying to finish that book, like it just ended up being so many tasks each and every mm -hmm. single day to try and keep up on. Because sometimes it'd be like, oh, I have to do my laundry. Plus, I have to add this new habit that I said I was going to. Plus, I have to edit this TikTok. Plus, I have to read 50 pages. Plus, I have to do this, this, Yeah, and I think we got a little in over our heads. But yeah. I do think, especially with the videos, I think that we learned a lot from it. Mm -hmm. Like, we definitely learned, like, our preference is, like, YouTube. Yeah. Um, but also, like, I think that we, like, we learned, like, the editing app more. Like, we yeah. use CapCut. Like, I think we learned more about that. Uh, I think I've learned no no amount of anything about what time we should post or what kind of posts we should make uh no, it, no rhyme or reason for why anything yeah. would do good or bad um but yeah we've gained we're up to 20 subscribers as which of today awesome. which is like you guys might not think that's a lot i i wasn't expecting us in the first couple months to have no any realistically i thought we'd have to have a, a hell of a lot more videos me too for us to have anybody so, thank you guys yeah. if you're one of our subscribers. And if you're not, click it right now. <laughs> Honestly, that kind of made the month worth it was it did, to we, see our subscriber yeah. count go up. Even though it might not be a big number to some, it really honestly kept us motivated mm -hmm. throughout the month when we really wanted to kind of quit posting everything. Mm -hmm. This month was supposed to basically be a reset like for our physical and like mental health and everything, but also a reset into deep diving to try and get into this probably shouldn't have done both at the same time yeah in hindsight in but hindsight. we told you this in our previous vlog where it's all or like, nothing is that out yeah that is out already <laughs> yeah we are all in. we week. don't have a we don't just like dip our toes in the water for things we're just like let's go in yeah. so now we've learned and i think it, at least for the foreseeable future we'll probably do like one long video a week mm -hmm. and then if we have to we'll post two yeah but for right now at least for the next few weeks we'll probably just have one a week just to give ourselves a little yeah. break <laughs> especially because like we we need to start stocking them up because we we need to hang out more we've just had weekends apart so we haven't had much that's true all the traveling has it. yeah we it's made it a lot more difficult time. yeah <laughs> so it's it's been a long month it's been a lot and we're not even technically through March. We still have two more days, but we just decided these last three I, days. It's like, it's Friday at 11.30. <laughs> so we have like a, a yeah. Yeah. <laughs> and we're filming this now because obviously it's Easter weekend and things are going to be busy mm -hmm. this weekend too. So we just mm -hmm. kind of wanted to give a recap and, and say that we learned some things. <laughs> and I'm proud of us for sticking with it the way we did both in our vlogging habits and our normal habits. I don't even really remember what. So health-wise habits, I guess we'll talk about that. Um, I don't even really exactly remember what I said. My goal is to get 10,000 steps a day, eat more protein, drink water. Um, and I did okay-ish. I did not walk nearly as much as I wanted to this month. I just really didn't. And so I kind of got down on myself with that. But I would say my eating habits were pretty decent. I didn't do anything crazy. I hit my protein a lot. Um, I just kind of picked up other habits too. Like two habits I wanted to really do was I wanted to wait an hour after waking up before I drank coffee to kind of help with cortisol levels. And I wanted to not look at my phone immediately when I woke up. I wanted to wait till I got up a little bit. And I really do like those two habits. Those I'm sticking with, I have consistently stuck with for the month. So I kind of told myself, if nothing else, I did those two. And I'm happy that I stuck with those two. There you go. So what about you? Um, I think that uh, for like those little ones I mentioned, like I didn't do great at doing those like every day. And I did at first, like the first two weeks I did them and then everything got thrown off. But uh, <laughs> he has to <laughs> join in every video. Come on, get up here. <laughs> get in. up here. <laughs> Bo yeah. says he's proud of you. Thank you. Thank you. Okay. Are you good? Oh. Okay. Hi, buddy. Um, but. Sorry, I hit your face. 
sorry. Um, but I think I did very well on, I wanted to like diversify my foods, like keep it healthy, keep it clean, but try to add in, especially more vegetables. I think I made the comment and I at least told Maria this, I really wanted to add more beans. I added a lot more beans this month. <laughs> They're really good for you. <laughs> um, so yeah, I like switched it up. I still, I like to like bulk make my meals. And so, or at least like, no, I, I like things quick and easy or I like to like make it like my lunches, I'll make 16 lunches at a time and freeze all of them. So that's why I eat like that. But so I diversified it, but it would still be like, I'd have a week of eating like the same mm -hmm. dinner and it was mainly my dinner I was switching up, but I think I did a lot better on things like that. And then I did, I also, I think I said I wanted to walk five times a week, and I think most weeks I probably hit that. This week, I did not. I was really busy at work, and it's been rainy and cold. Yeah. Like, it was beautiful out the weeks before, but every other week, I was probably doing more. I was probably walking almost every day. If it was nice out, I would be doing at least one walk a day. I was getting my boyfriend in on it. We're walking my dog. We're walking his dogs. Um, so that I liked. I feel like it like got me outside a lot more, which made me feel better. Hmm. And then, what else did I do? I feel like I had another thing. <laughs> Thank More you. posty this time. Thank you. <laughs> uh, what did I do? I don't know. Anyways. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. It's late. <laughs> it is. Um, but yeah, so I think that I, I didn't walk inside on like my walking pad during work, which I need to incorporate that back in. But overall, I'm really happy with myself. And I am consistent with my working out normally, like my lifting schedule. But I did switch it up in like the last two months. And I'm just very proud. Like I feel like my immune system's doing a lot better because it is like knock on wood. It's very rare for me to not get sick like at all. Yeah, that's true. For like, I think I was sick in the beginning of February. Like not sick, sick, but like like stuffiness and mm. I feel like everybody around me has gotten sick this month and my immune system has been good enough to ward that off for me and that that's big for me that means I'm doing something okay that's true. and that's a win I and that was with doing my workouts to like the full extent because usually if I'm starting to feel a little gross I need to like reel that back in because of my Hashimoto's so I'll like take a step back and go a few days without the gym I didn't miss even a singular rep. Like, I did everything I was supposed to lifting-wise this month. And I told Maria, I'm I'm beat to shit. Like, my elbow's swollen. I have bruises all over me. And it's just, like, random. It all happened in this last week. And I was like, maybe I need a break. Yeah. I think it kind of is time for it. I think we need a reset from a reset. <laughs> <laughs> it's just been a lot mentally. Mm -hmm. I feel like we're trying. I, physical health might have been better, I guess, for both of us. But... Mental health, I don't know if we necessarily reset. No, I we're think we stress ourselves more, out. Yeah. We wanted to have more grace with ourselves. Um, is it Maria? I think it's <laughs> Probably both here. Um, <laughs> we wanted to have more grace with ourselves, and I feel like in some cases we did, but almost every time we did, it's like we had to justify it to each other. Yeah. And I think that was not what we were going for. Like this week, like I said, I got back and like had to catch up on everything, and I really just wanted to finish the book. And I had quite a bit to read. So instead of coming home and walking, I kept coming home and just reading for like two hours. But I did finish the book this week. And well, I had to... Good. That's something yeah. you wanted to do and it's something that relaxes you and you enjoy. And I had to like tell myself because I was having like this mental battle with it where I said reading is fine. Reading is good. This is something I enjoy. I'm mm -hmm. unwinding. Like I just need to chill out and let it go. But it's hard. I don't you? know how you felt. I kept feeling like like you would be disappointed in me if I didn't do it. And then we'd talk and like neither one of us be. cared. <laughs> Just kidding. Yeah. We both there. Like I was like, we, we said we'd do this and I let her down. And then like I text her and she's like, I don't care. No, <laughs> so no. I was like, okay. I was actually, I can't tell you how like baffled I am that we posted even as much as we did. I, this is, that we I know we're not doing anything. the last couple days. I do technically have one I can post today. I'm not going to. I don't they're, know. We'll they're not good. We know they're not good. This is really just to like get yeah. stuff out there and to like get used to it. We just do the same things every day and it's yeah. really hard. Yeah, that's what we both said too. We found out we're very boring mm -hmm. people. Like when you very do the routine. same thing. Well, yeah. But then you tell yourself you're going to post that every day. And then you're like, shit, people are watching the same thing over and over again. 
So maybe you guys will be happy to also not see our recess yeah. stuff anymore. Yeah, our shorts and TikToks, whatever you see us on, are probably going to be more geared towards like what our, our long videos are. Yeah. And then like here and there, we'll we'll make a, make one. But it's not going to it's not gonna be an everyday thing. No. Especially not twice a day. I am proud. We did a lot. We did. But that's the end of that era. Yep. <laughs> Goodbye, March reset. On to two days early. Whatever the hell April brings. <laughs> <laughs> I think I think it'll be more fun because now I think we have a baseline of like yeah. we kind of know how to edit now. Like we kind of have like a flow for it. And now that we're not so jam packed with everything, yeah. we can just pr like put out the things we actually enjoy and actually have fun with. Yeah, that's true. So I think it'll end up better. April is going to be focusing on fun. Fun. All summer long. We're all counting April long. as the beginning of summer, even though it's not. Yeah. But it's all summer long. We're having fun. Yeah. So that's that's our recap. Yeah. So think about the gist of things. <laughs> what do you think? You guys might think we failed, but this is better than we anticipated. I know. <laughs> I'm actually, honestly, I am very proud of us. Yeah. I'm very proud of us for how much we stuck with it. I didn't think we would. <laughs> We only missed a few days. I thought we would miss weeks. I thought I we think would... maybe five days total we missed. Maybe. Like of nobody posting, and that's including like today, tomorrow, and the next day. And then I think we only had two days where neither one of us posted. Yeah. Yeah. Honestly, I fully expected us to get two weeks into this and then stop. I wanted to. <laughs> I hated it. I know. I think I texted her every day, and I was like, don't ever expect <laughs> me to make a TikTok ever again. <laughs> but... Yeah, like two weeks ago, she was like, I literally will not make a short form content. Don't expect me for weeks after this one. I'm like, we still have two weeks of posting to go, but okay. I want to do it. <laughs> yeah, no, they're not I fun. was like, I'm doing it right now, but I will not be doing it after. No, they're not fun. So, mm -hmm. so we're done with that. Sorry if you liked seeing the reset posts. I don't know if there anybody is who did. But <laughs> it's probably not what we're going to post anymore, so... I think that we just like pigeon I think it was a good idea in theory and we were talking about this a little earlier where I think if we didn't give ourselves this narrow thing to post about so just like the March reset yeah that we would have posted less like we would have been like well what do we do today so we were bored with the content because we do the same things every day so it was like how do we put this differently and then it's like okay but it was really like an accountability thing so it doesn't need to be different and also yeah. we don't have a big follower base so People probably aren't seeing our videos repetitively. Yeah. Um, but we think we would have made better, more fun content that felt more authentic to us if we didn't have that pigeonhole on yeah. us. But we would have probably posted less. Yeah, if we gave ourselves a little bit more freedom, it might have been a little bit more bearable, but mm -hmm. we didn't. The idea sounded good in theory, and it necessarily wasn't a bad idea. Mm -hmm. It just didn't really give, like, I kind of wanted March to be, like, a really big over, like, like I said, like, physical and kind of mental reset mm -hmm. for us. And I think it was a little stressful. Yeah. So. It's over. <laughs> here's Yay. to doing more fun things and sleeping more in April. Yes. <laughs> Stay tuned. <laughs> and comment, like, subscribe. Um, tell us what you guys want to see. For our 20 subscribers, or maybe you guys could subscribe now and be 21, or maybe it'll be more by then. So it would make us really happy. It would. We also we, keep us going. Yeah, I want you guys to know that every time it goes up, we do acknowledge it to each other. There's a text <laughs> sent in all caps with us freaking out every time it goes up by one. Yep. <laughs> <laughs> if we make it to 100 subscribers, I would probably start posting every day again. <laughs> What's your number? Maybe. <laughs> 500 subscribers. I could even see, okay, maybe then I could see, like, if we mean every day, like, we trade off every other day. Oh, yeah. Yeah, that's Like, true. I don't want to do, like, myself every day again. Yeah. Unless, I don't know. Because maybe by then we'd have, like, a thing to talk about more often, if that makes sense. Maybe. I think I'm just still in the mindset where I'm like, I don't want to record my walks or my workout. Yeah. That's, yeah. It just gets old. Same thing, so. Mm -hmm. It did kind of help me get over like my gym camera you did phobia. Like in the I, gym a lot. Yeah, I, I even brought a I have already owned a tripod for it. I've been too embarrassed to use it for years. Which like a lot of people at my gym use them. So it's really not an embarrassing thing. 
but I, I just couldn't get past it, so I forced myself to do it, and so that helped a little bit, so that was a good thing. There you go. I don't, I don't love doing it, but I did it. <laughs> I don't think I gained anything of that sort from posting every day, but yeah. <laughs> that's, that's all I got. <laughs> we tried. <laughs> I'm tired. Yeah, it's late. So we're gonna we're gonna end this here. So yeah, comment, like, subscribe, and thank you guys for watching. And we'll see you next time. Bye. Bye. Okay, I gotta go home. I gotta go to bed. <laughs>